What is up YouTube, Nick from Tutorial Tellers, and today I'll be showing you guys how to get a cool background for your computer. Now this is one of the most asked questions on my comment section is where did you get that background from and how can I get it? Now I want to start off this video saying that this does cost money and to be exact it does cost $3.99 USD. You're also going to be needing a Steam account if you don't have one already go to store.steampower.com I'll leave this link in the description down below so be sure to check that out. Once you've made your Steam account or for those who already have your Steam account you want to head on over to the Steam store. Once on the Steam store, at the top right, you should see search the store and go ahead and click that box and type in wallpaper engine. It should be the very first one that costs $3.99 and the picture is of a Mustang. Once you've found wallpaper engine, go ahead and purchase it. Once you've purchased it, it should look a little something like this. And for those who are wondering what my wallpaper is called, it's called Hexagon Advanced Edition. You can also have a digital clock so right now, as you guys see right here, 1126. And I'm gonna show you guys one more example. Techno looks pretty cool. Here's another one. I have multiple monitors, two to be exact, and it kind of stretches out to the other monitor as well. And you can also change the settings right here. And for more advanced settings, click on this little icon right here. And you can see that there is a bunch of options. Now Wallpaper Engine has thousands of wallpapers. So you just want to go to Workshop. And here are some previews of some wallpapers. As you guys can see, there's 60 pages right here. But if I go ahead and filter the results, there's a bunch of tags and options like this. So there's a bunch, I can go to cartoon, and if I refresh this, it's kind of buggy. And you can also search up what you're looking for. And it's really simple and straightforward. If you guys need any help, comment down below in this video and I'll try to help you guys to the best of my knowledge. That's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next video.